This is a photo of Major General Horatio Gordon Robley of the British Army with his collection of Maori trophy heads. Before the British settlers arrived, the native Maori people were preserving the heads of their fallen loved ones. This process was called Moko Make. This was done by removing the brains and eyes, sealing them shut with wire and gum. They then boiled and smoked their heads and finally dipping them in shark oil. The families kept them like trophies and bringing them out during special ceremonies. When the British arrived, they were quickly looted by the soldiers. At one point in history, they became an expensive collector's item, and since it was during a period of destabilization, tribes carried out raids on the neighbors to acquire more heads, to trade for weapons and ammunition. After Horatio returned to England, he built up a large collection of roughly 35 to 40 Moko Makai, which he later offered to sell to the New Zealand government. When the offer was declined, the collection was sold to the American Museum of Natural History. If you enjoy true crime, strange occurrences, and scary stories, Check out the full-length videos on my Disturbing Truth YouTube channel.